five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The countdown is on. As 13 girls get one last practice in at the Colorado School of Mines. Good. Watch the Gatorade bottle, guys. In minutes, the Manitou Springs Mustangs will compete against other top teams. Guys, take a deep breath. That was a great run through. Cheerleaders from across the front range take center stage, showcasing spirit and synchronicity. The Manitou Springs Mustangs huddle one last time. Manitou! Manitou! Please welcome to the floor Manitou Springs Cheer. For the first time joining them in competition is 16 year old Corey Mitchell. She's full of life and full of energy, and she always wants to be a part of everything. Her mom, Bonnie King, watches with pride. <laughs> and a daughter who's wanted to be a cheerleader since elementary school. Yeah, Her mom is emotional. Yeah. But learning these already complicated routines is harder for Corey. It's just a tough road when you have a differently abled child. And to see them have a sense of belonging and acceptance is just what she wants, of course. And it's just so beautiful to see it. Happy Corey's teammates see what's under the surface. I love that this team has been so accepting of her because they teach her, but she also has things to teach them. Things like courage, patience, and unconditional friendship. She's pretty spunky. She's, she's got some sass, and she loves being out there. It's, it's nice to see her smile and just be like part of the team. Sometimes competitions aren't about who wins. And in second place, let's put our hands together for Manatee Springs. <laughs> but a little hardware doesn't hurt. Corey accepts the trophy and a hand from the rest of the Mustangs. It's my dream come true. I love my girls a lot. A big fan to Lita. And Corey's teammates are big fans of her. In Golden, Tammy V. Hill, Fox 31, Denver.